Welcome back to consecutive day 1046 of a diary of a runpreneur. And today I want to talk to you about your marketing sales funnels within hours. So uh, please give us a subscribe, share, like, and comment as the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise on my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon. All the information about the challenge taking get involved is in the link in the comments below. Thank you as always, and let's get started. So, consecutive day 1046 of a diary of a runpreneur. And uh, yeah, today's topic is uh, your marketing sales funnels within hours. Now, this is huge. And the reason for this is that I've, I've, I've studied marketing for years and uh, never been particularly good at it, but I've always understood it. And uh, that kind of puts me in a, a relatively unique position. Um, the issue I always had was with my copywriting and design, predominantly. Um, predominantly the copywriting because obviously the importance of headlines, you know, sales copy, all this type of stuff which is so instrumental in engagement and conversion is something that I couldn't do. I understood the kind of logistics, intricacies, automations, all that type of stuff. I understood the strategies behind marketing and sales funnels. But um, the copywriting design was something I just hated. And even bringing people in, I found it incredibly difficult to articulate what I wanted to get the copy done at, at the right level. So as a result, I stagnated. Now, um, roll on the back end of 2022 and the kind of early part of 2023, where um, ChatGPT in particular, along with a lot of new artificial intelligence tools have been created. And all of a sudden we have the ability to get copywriting design done by artificial intelligence at an incredibly accessible and affordable price. And um, that's what's led me to today's topic, really. Um, I've been speaking about this a while, about some kind of this year being the year of stability, i.e. de-risking my position or an over-reliance on certain revenue streams and to build new ones, similar to a property portfolio. When you buy your first property and you start renting it out, you're incredibly risky because if one tenant moves out, you're stuck servicing all the overhead yourself. When you have two, three, four, five, six, and and beyond properties, one void becomes apparent. The other five or six properties will usually quite comfortably cover that over that overhead, that additional overhead, giving you time to get it retenanted and cash flowing again. And that's the same with properties, oh, sorry, the same with businesses. If you have one business which is paying you well, and then all of a sudden something goes on with that business and that income starts to dry out, then uh, obviously your total income is is exposed. Whereas if you have multiple businesses generating a share of your income, if, if something goes wrong with one revenue stream, then the others can usually pick up the slack until you fix the problems to get the revenue streamed back in place. So roll on the first kind of new business that we're in the process of launching. And it's a, a marketing agency. And um, the interesting thing here is that we've niched in a kind of a a stranger area because um, you know marketing is such a broad topic and ultimately um, you know that we couldn't really niche too deep on the actual target demographic so we niched quite quite um, you know um, very very focused on a specific marketing strategy and um, this strategy is called the dream 100 now um, dream 100 is something I can't remember his surname, Chad something or other, came up with the concept. And um, Russell Brunson picked up on this. Russell, Russell Brunson's my kind of marketing hero, if you like, somebody who I've followed in, in you know, um, in great depth. And um, Russell Brunson is uh, someone who's super, super successful. And he said that, uh, I quote him on this, he said that people pay me $100,000, $200,000 a day for marketing, marketing consultancy. And the one thing he will do in that day is take them through the Dream 100 process, 
which is quite staggering, really. So if he's saying that, it's clearly one of the top priorities from his perspective. Success leaves clues, so hence we're going to niche down on supporting the micro business owners with the Dream 100 strategy. So we've built this processing system uh, using artificial intelligence to enable us to build a Dream 100. We've rebranded um, our Dream 100 process as Boost 100 because we want to exponentially boost the get the, the, the new micro business owner to level up their business up to 10x times by utilizing the Boost 100 strategy. And there's several ways in which we can do this. So first and foremost, we're going to create a lead magnet, which is we will, for free, generate your Boost 100 list. Now we use artificial intelligence to do this and we'll capture data about the business owner to do that. But what an invaluable tool to do that for free. We're then going to upsell them. And part of that Boost 100 process is we're going to teach them the process, what's entailed, how they go about doing it. Again, over a seven day course for free. So that's, that's our lead magnet, which is quite phenomenal. But once, the reason we're targeting micro business owners is because A, usually time is an issue for them. They don't have a huge team to kind of help them help with this type of stuff. And uh, obviously resource can be a bit of an issue in terms of monetary and labor. So we're trying to make this incredibly accessible to the micro business owner. And the upsell is, is that if they want us to kind of give them all the tools to be able to do this much easier, i.e. all the links to be able to connect with everybody and all the companies, you know, websites, media outlets, influencers on their, on their Boost 100 list, we can have all the links ready for them in clickable format on a PDF. We can have all the nurturing messages, sales pipeline, facility, all readily available for them to make this process so much easier for a one-off fee of we're looking at possibly 495. And then the upsell from that is if even then they're still finding it too hard to, to, to kind of manage the process, then we'll offer a done for you system service, which will be more like 495 per month. Um, most marketing agencies are charging anything, but usually somewhere around the 1500 pounds a month or more. So again, this is incredibly accessible and affordable for even the micro business owners. And we'll put all the guarantees and everything in place. But the reason for today's topic is not only we're we hugely excited about this new opportunity, but more so that we mapped out the sales funnel with all the copy and everything within a couple of hours using um, automatic, you know, artificial intelligence, predominantly chat GPT. And it's so, so amazing to be able to do that, to get sales copy, everything created, done. Okay, there's some marginal amendments to be done, but we're pretty much ready now to get the design done using AI uh, this week and then integrating it into our new marketing software, Go High Level, next week. And then our funnel's ready to launch, which is amazing. And the first thing we'll do is obviously practice what we preach. We'll run the Boost 100 process for our marketing agency to reach out to people who can be affiliates for us um, to help really drive the traffic into our into our marketing funnel. So, um, so, so excited about this because now that I've been through the process once, of course, I'm going to build marketing sales funnels for all of the businesses and I can get those boxes off real quick, run them through the new marketing agency and um, I'm so, so excited. I think this is a huge opportunity. I think we're well ahead of the game in terms of um, <laughs> coming to market with such an offering. And uh, I think if we get in front of the right people as quickly as possible, I think it's gonna be a huge, huge success. So the moral to the story is, um, if you're not using artificial intelligence to amplify and take your business to the next level, you're severely missing out. And um, we're certainly gonna be capitalizing on that now as a complete business. And I believe this can be a real lean startup where gross margins could be in excess of 80% with very little overhead. I think the net could probably be somewhere within the 70, 75%, which makes it hugely profitable. Um, utilizing my experience of outsourcing to remote workers overseas, again, we can keep the labor overhead considerably low, automate as much as possible. I'm so, so excited about this opportunity. So that's it for me today. Any questions or comments, drop me a line. I'll respond to everyone. Do remember to give this a subscribe, share, like, and comment. As the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise on my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultramarathon. Thank you as always for your support. Stay positive, stay happy, and I'll see you again tomorrow.